All right, everybody. Ooh. Okay, hold up. I'm sorry, my music was way too loud and my cats are pressing buttons. Is this good? It might still be too loud. All right, this should be fine. Okay, there we go. Just a little bit of music in the background. So I got a juicy game for you today. Okay? This is me on Darius versus Nasus. And I'm gonna int my ass off. And you're gonna see what's actually gonna happen. <laughs> ay ay ay. This is a juicy game. Alright, let, let's start. This is a 16 minute game. This is gonna be a quick video. And I am a little bit AFK at the start, but it's fine. We times four this sucker. I'm gonna show you guys how to play into Nasus when you're inting your ass off. And how to actually win the game. But, bear in mind my team is actually quite decent. And they are really trying to win this game. Uh, this is gold one to low plat. Okay. High gold, low plat, low. If I recall. I do need to check. But I am pretty sure. I'm hoping OBS doesn't crash on me again. I do need to check real quick. This was actually a low plat game. Cause my my uh my MMR kind of bad. Let's see. Um, no, this is actually uh, it's pretty balanced. Gold one to gold three. Okay, gold one to gold four. Actually, my ass was gold four. Pretty pretty balanced. Pretty spread out teams. Oh yeah, just as per usual, pushing in. We are playing Call Darius. These are the runes. I am playing the exact same runes as I am playing uh, on Singed. Like, I I was supposed to play Singed this game, but then I saw Nasus and I was like, nah, it's not gonna happen. So instead of playing Singed, I chose to play the next best thing, which is Darius, the 1v5 machine. Quite literally. And uh, uh, I'm gonna go and perma into this game. This Yasuo just executed himself into enemy territory right here. He got chased by... That. <laughs> All right, and um, I'm actually gonna die to Nasus because, well, his fucking poke is annoying and his wither is just omega cringe. So, here's what happens. Usually on Darius, you would go Stride Breaker or Trinity Force. They're both kind of bad into Nasus. So, what do you play into Nasus? Well, if you want a hard carry, you're going Divine Sunderer into Black Cleaver. Because Dar uh, Darius is really good with both those items. I don't need to chase Nasus, I just need to kill his team. But I do want to be able to kill everybody. Alistar included. Nasus included. I'm going Divine Sonderer into Black Cleaver. Because Black Cleaver really, really works with your passive. A lot of people still don't know, but this passive actually stacks Black Cleaver. Okay? Read the passive. Gonna, I'm gonna let you guys read this. Now, you're noticing that I'm heavily losing. Uh, yes, I am, in fact, heavily losing. I'm getting shit on right now, but I'm quite a bit ahead of in gold. Okay, I'm 300 gold. Now, we're gonna go even because his basic attack range just hits me all the way over there. Which is kind of cringe, by the way. And should not be allowed, but it's, it's fine, I guess. I am currently behind at this point. Cat, please stop pressing buttons. Jesus Christ. Okay, so my queen is actually demolishing their bot lane. I am kind of losing, but not really. You're gonna see why in like the last two, two to three minutes. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. They they really thought I was the weak link, and you're you're gonna see why I said that. Uh, I'm going 0-4 this game. And that's gonna change in a single fight. And I'm basically gonna solo everything. The second I get Divine Cleaver, this game's over. Uh, not even Divine Cleaver, I just just the Divine. But yeah, the second you would get Divine Cleaver on Darius, the game's over. Wither, however, this Nasus is playing really, really well. The Wither into Darius is extremely good because you literally cannot land your, your outside zone of the queue. And uh, if you cannot land the outside zone, then your your Q is basically useless and you're not healing yourself, which is very cringe. Very cringe. 
and it does oh my god it, it does three times less damage okay so you you really want to hit the outside zone the sweet spot okay now i've seen a lot of darius people just rushing uh w max second which is kind of bad like sure okay i see what you mean by by doing this but this is armor penetration guys it's 35 percent it's a full item okay this is basically Lord Dom's. Why would you not uh, max this second? Is beyond my comprehension. As both a Darius player, as a League of Legends player in general, as a veteran, as a ranked player, as everything, just it doesn't make any sense. Even if I would not play League of Legends, this is just obviously the better option overall. Now I'm gonna get shit on here. <laughs> yes, I am behind 300 gold at this point. Okay, there's Nasus perma low mana, but I'm bla I'm basically playing a uh, singed Darius, okay? Because I'm perma pushing into the Nasus, my guy is low mana. He he needs people to be sent on top to deal with me, because otherwise he's not gonna be able to if he's perma low mana. Now he does actually get a window to get away, but as you can see, my team is shitting on them. So it's fine, and uh, they actually thought. Hmm, this Darius is getting shit on. Maybe it's time we play topside. And they're gonna start sending people top. That's the worst fucking mistake of your lives, people. Do not send people top. Especially into Darius, into Singed, into anybody that knows how to proxy or how to how to 1v5, okay? I am dying, yes, but they sent three fucking people top. And they're gonna lose bot side for this. Okay? Sure, the Nas this Nasus is getting fed. He's gonna be 4 0 at the end of this game. He's ahead 600 gold, but can he solo carry? No. Could he solo carry? Yes, potentially. But will be will he be able to? Will he be able to play late game Nasus into Darius? No. The reason is because I'm going Black Cleaver, Divine Sonderer. And you just cannot play into that. Like, if you're playing late game Darius. You literally kill everything, because this champion is busted as fuck. You do like a thousand true damage on your R, and if your your passive stacks Black Cleaver, your, your attacks stack Black Cleaver, you're just gonna ruin their day. Also, uh, Divine Sonderer, never mind, we just got it. Alright, let's back off 20 seconds. This is where the game turns around. So you're seeing me 0-3, okay? Remember I said they're gonna send people top because they think I'm the weak link and they think they're gonna get a bunch of kills here because I got two squishies with me and I'm basically behind as fuck. No, I'm not because I got Divine Sonderer. This Nasus has no items. He has a plated steel caps and that's about it. He, he does not have a finished item. I have a huge power spike over him. Back. We are point fiving this fight. Alright, this guy gets caught out. I noticed the guy getting caught out. Watch me. This is how you play when you're behind. You do not give a fuck, okay? Especially if you're a strong champion like Darius, like Singed. You do not give a fuck. I pop Ghost. Soon. They just die, bro. They just die. They thought I was the weak link. No, I'm the strongest fucking member of the team. I am 1v4. I do not give a fuck. Bear in mind, I have Divine Sonderer ready to go. We do not give a fuck, brothers. This is where the game ends. I hope you enjoyed the video. And uh, if you don't believe me that this game ends right here, we basically have a minute to go. <laughs> Let's times for this, I guess. But if you guys enjoyed this quick ass video and how to actually play when behind, sure, we died here, but they're forced to forfeit. Because they got nothing on my team. And I was just basically soloing them. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, I will see you guys next time.